art, specifically poor art. You may have seen it on TikTok. You may have seen it here on YouTube. You also may have seen other creators attempting to create beautiful poor art. Well, today, Ilsa and I are going to create the best, the greatest, the most creative poor art you've ever seen in your entire life. So pretty much acrylic poor art is where you manipulate a bunch of paint in a cup or a bucket. You pretty much pour it onto a canvas and you move the canvas around, you play around with the patterns and it just ends up looking so cool. So today, Ilsa and I are going to give it a go. I, I just want to say it, we are, you know, pretty good artists. Wait till you see the video. We're pretty bloody good artists, okay? Gloves on! I just had a stupid thought in my head. Like, is this what wearing a condom would feel That's like? That's literally what I thought. <laughs> I didn't want to say it, and I was like, why do you get those colors? Because I'm the guest. <laughs> and this is my channel. Bro, there is going to be, there is about to be so many wiki feet things. I don't have a pedicure, okay? I don't want to hear it. Aren't you already a 4.4 out of 5, though? Like, uh, Elsa is checking out my wiki feet in her spare time. I don't Kind of weird. It. Okay. Sorry. Where did these come in? <laughs> so first up, we've got to fill this cup with uh, this questionable liquid. So next up, we're going to grab the little shot glasses. We're going to do one part water, one part primer, and one part paint. Oh my god, this is a lot for my brain to handle. And we're going to do that for each and every colour that we want to put on the canvas. Okay, I'm going to do like a pink themed, I think. I think I'm going to do like... I was going to do... Were you going to do pink? You for pinks? I was going to do a sunset. A sunset? You're going to do a sunset? Well, I'm not anymore. So what are you gonna do? Um, I don't know, now I'm vibing like a grape. <laughs> Aesthetic. Okay, I have put the uh, questionable looking liquid in the shot glasses. Now it's time to put the water and then the paint. Do I look like I know what I'm doing? I know what I'm doing. I swear to God, I know what I'm doing. Do you know what you're doing? I have no idea what I'm doing. Shh, I copy. I'm just copying you. One part water, one part semen, oh! and one part paint. <laughs> this is my color palette. I think it's quite fun. I'm excited, look at that. I'm, listen, you have to trust the process and there was a bit there where I was questioning whether or not it was gonna look decent, the actual paint. So I'm excited. I'm, I'm looking forward to how it's gonna turn out. The next step is we grab another cup and we grab some white acrylic paint and you do white layer, color. White layer, color. Wow, amazing. <laughs> yours is gonna make a mess. Yours is gonna look good though, because yours is less watery. How's it looking? How's it cooking? Good looking. <laughs> I mean, it's layering. Oh, that's nice. Good job, Ilsa. That one had well a bit done. more to it. Who's the artist here? Not me. Not me. All right, so now is the moment of truth. The next step is yeah. to either you can grab the cup and pour it on, you can grab the canvas, go like that, and then just see what happens, or it's up to you. I think we're going to try this method. Maybe for the next one, we'll do something different. So, like this. Ready? One, two, three. Oh, I don't know how that went. Oh, okay. Oh, oh God, you see, look at mine. Mine's leaking out. Ready? <laughs> <laughs> it does kind of have the bird kind of thing we were worried about. And then you what? You like, yeah, you smush it. Oh, it's kind of cool though. Lava. Oh, it's sick. It looks like lava, like a pink. The colors, yeah, but look at that, bro. It literally <laughs> looks like shit. I'm gonna do a little, if you get what I mean. Oh, okay, so we're doing like fancy tricks. Oh, God. This plus <laughs> this equals brown. <laughs> that does look sick. The inside of my cup looks kind of cool. Okay. It's all right. It, trust the process, it will get better. That looks kind of sick. That, right, that, like that? Yeah, yeah, for sure. My colors are making poo brown. It looks like a, it looks like a, like a melted ice cream on a hot, a hot summer's day. It looks like a demon, like that thing on the left is its arm. It's just like, <gasps> yeah. wow, I'm actually proud of that. Well, Oops. this was the practice one. We've got the big canvas True. next. True. Okay, now that we have, been through our first experience of acrylic pour art. It's time to try it on a larger canvas. Yes. Now we know what not to do. We know what to do. I still don't know what to do, but I know what not to do. You guys can be the judge of who, who did the better painting. I think obviously mine is a little bit more plain and basic, but Ilsa's hasn't even covered the entire cam canvas. So like, I, I don't know, you be the judge. Just do, does the exact same one. <laughs> Just I'm bigger. Nothing if not consistent. <laughs> you know the drill. One part primer, one part water, one part paint. Let's get it. I love art. 
I love, I love craft. This is great. We are epic. Does what does green and blue equal? More like a bluey green? <laughs> like, like an aqua? Is what are I meant? You? Does blue and green equal bluey green? <laughs> the moment we've all been waiting for. Not really, but I'm gonna right, do it go one first. at a time instead. Yeah, you go first. But that's not gonna work. Oh, you okay, go first. Work. Okay, fine. I'll go first. Jeez. Oh. Ooh. And then just do it. Fuck it. That actually worked. Kind of did, eh? Alright, I'm just gonna do like a. I might just do like. Ooh. That's fun. So yours has a lot more movement to it. Maybe I should move this one around first before I. See, that's like, what yeah, that's nice. Like? The layers. Yay. Dude, mine okay. dope. I don't know, mine cool toned one's looking kind of fun. If I say so myself. Yeah, that looks sick. Yeah, like that looks like, looks like a, one of those gems. You know those? Yeah, like a crystal I'd have yeah. fun. Oh my God, this looks so cool. I said, Tanner, yours are basic and pink. Ilsa has at least tried something. Show me these paintings, who's is who's? Mine are the basic ones. Oh, I agree with Lennon. But why would you do this, Tanner? What is this? Well, listen, man. What is the talent in that? Are you seriously going to act like hers is better? It's way better. I'm just un like, see, this to me, right? This to me is like fire. It's passion. It's creativity. It's color. It's beauty. Bro, don't Lennon. lie. It looks like a five-year-old did that in kindergarten. What about this one? That's like, it's okay. I like this one the best. <gasps> Actual? Yeah, because it kind of looks like an ocean. Yeah, I think that one's definitely the best because it covers the whole canvas. Yeah, I agree. I agree. I think you've made a mistake by not covering the whole canvas. Yeah. I tried! It's dude, in the light, it looks good. Yeah, yours is alright, Tana. It's probably the best one. That one's, I gotta be honest. I accepted more. No, but you. if if it covered the canvas, it would be better, but it doesn't. I, I do think that's the best one. Yeah. I can't lie to you. Yeah. I, I made a promise I would never lie to you about anything. But I, you just came in here and said mine was way better, and now I'm confused. Because it seems like you've just <laughs> fallen out. that, also. You both for 180. Did they not? So, yes well, or no, who did the best one? We had to take the opportunity to insult Tanner, but then we had to use Look, our, okay, our let integrity came Let me work. justify my answer. Ilsa's is more vibrant, meaning it caught mine first. But upon further investigation, I feel like Tanner's is the better painting. Because it covers the whole canvas. No, oh, that's the only reason. No, I'm not, that's not the only reason. It just looks cool. Can I have that $10 now for saying that? <laughs> Well, there you have it. That is uh, Ilsa and Tenna try acrylic pour art. Do you think we did a good job? Who do you think did a better job? I think it all comes down to the eye of the beholder. The beauty, you know, it's all dependent on what your style is. I think mine's awesome, but I also think Ilsa's is dope. I'm trying to make it sound like we actually did a decent job, but we, we really f***ed up. Make sure you subscribe to Ilsa's channel, and uh, if you subscribe to her channel, then this will never happen again, I promise you. That's what they want. They don't want us to do this again. This is this is rough, dude.